say thank you. Mm. How would you recommend lay, lay people, um, people not in traditional academia, um, studying science, either as a hobby or wanting to maybe go into it professionally from an unorthodox angle? Well, I think, uh, I think the, obvious, um, um, the, the obvious way to go about at least starting that kind of process is by reading um, a lot of articles from, uh, say, Scientific American or the or physics, to, um, or at least a little somewhat higher level physics today, and so on and so forth. Um, that's basically the way I I I, I, I approached it when I um, uh, when I had volunteered, well, I would say to do a course on general relativity and cosmology. Um, I knew nothing about the subject when I was starting out, so I. Uh, uh, I basically start. I quite literally started off with Scientific American and, uh, <laughs> and worked upwards from from there. And it sort of works, <laughs> um, but but I mean there really are quite a lot of rather good um, d discussions of these uh, fairly advanced topics um, in that kind of journal. And once you take advantage of it, I think.